Hey guys, so Lena is back in the news again today for yet another TikTok. About kids, like you know my kids. I do know your kids. How do you know my kids? I know your kids because I know your baby daddy. I know your baby daddy because I sit on his like almost every other night. So, of course, people in the comments were saying things like, she knows exactly what she doing. Child Neek done leveled up. She ain't bothered. She knew what she was doing. Then someone else says, this why she stay getting dragged on Twitter. Now, someone else did state, y'all finna take this and run with it. Let this girl live OMG. Now, Lena did state in the comments, I promise y'all my life and TikToks don't correlate with anybody else's life. It's a trend, just a TikTok, all fun. Now, to me, in order for her to actually pin this in the comments, she already knew what was coming. So now, should she limit what she posts on TikTok because she knows the fans are going to take it a certain way? Or should she just do her and post whatever TikTok she wants? Now, I do agree with some of these comments. Lena knows exactly what she's doing. She's been down this road before. She knew once she posted that TikTok that people in the comments were going to assume that she was talking about Neek. Now, a few weeks prior, Neek posted the exact same TikTok. Asking about kids like you know my kids. I do know your kids. How do you know my kids? I know your kids because I know your baby daddy. I know your baby daddy because I sit on his like almost every other night. And then... So Neek, of course, did not receive the same reaction as Lena, although Neek could be placed in a similar situation because they could have stated that she was throwing shade at her boyfriend's baby mama. But anyways, let's move on to this next topic. So now last week, I reported that Lauren let everyone know that she was single and she was no longer with Joelle. Well, just yesterday, Joel posted a video on his YouTube page titled Reverse Gold Digger Prank. Now, Lauren was actually in this video. Now, I don't know. This video could have been shot when they were together, but at the end of the video, you can tell that that was recent and it looks like Joel is still at their home. So guys, we're just gonna have to see how this plays out because Joel said that Lauren is about to start doing gold digger pranks on her channel. So I'm guessing we'll see if they're back together officially or not sooner or later. Our Instagram, go follow her Instagram. I'm gonna pop it up here. Hey, don't go sliding her DMs talking crazy because I will respond with a video message talking back to y'all. So, so now let's get on to this next topic with these car raffle giveaways. Now, if you guys do not know what is going on here, then I don't know where you've been because it seems like all YouTubers are giving away cars now for raffle tickets. Now, about a month ago, I reported that Armand and Trey jumped on the bandwagon and in the comments, people were calling them scammers. Now, this has been about a month ago and I haven't heard anything about them announcing a winner as well as they removed all the promo from their Instagram pages. So now if you guys actually purchased a ticket, did they announce a winner or did they just completely drop out of the whole raffle thing? Anyways, people were upset because Chris Sells also pushed his date back. At first, he was ending the raffle on February 28th. Then he changed it to March 31st. So what I'm guessing is not enough people purchased tickets and he he didn't make enough money so he had to push it back but I don't know I'm guessing we'll see on March 31st what happens there now funny Mike also recently announced that he too is going to be participating in one of these raffle giveaways man I done partnered up with Jay we finna do a raffle giveaway $10 to enter them you can win the red Lamborghini you can win the purple Hellcat third place $3,000 Fourth place, fifteen hundred. Make sure you get a ticket. Link in the description. 
Now, I'm definitely not going to say that this is a scam because I don't know. What I did state in my previous video is that they're selling these tickets from $10 to $25. They're making double the amount of the car. Then at the end of the raffle, they're giving the cars away. I mean, Corey did just announce that he gave his truck away. He showed the guy coming and picking up the cars. So I don't know. You guys take it how you want to take it. If you want to purchase a ticket for your chance to win or or not but funny mike did go on to instagram live to explain the whole thing and how it's not a scam about in the comments say, man that's a scam they ain't giving with them calls for real shit buy your ticket find out your name pop out when whenever we these 60 days up you win i'm gonna be live the whole time i'm gonna get everybody to see the process so shit do you I don't live in Houston. Can I still do the raffle? Yeah. Shout out to everybody that entered so far. It's a lot of people. So what we gonna do, shit? I'm feeling generous right now. I said 60 days, so shit. I said 60 days, we gonna give away both of them. But what I'm gonna do now, shit, since so many people then got in that motherfucker, I'm gonna give away the Hellcat in 30 days. Just so y'all can see, we gonna go live and y'all gonna see how this shit go. So with 30 days, the hell can't go on. So whoever, shout out to everybody that jumped, jumped in. I'm gonna go live, I'm gonna show y'all. It's legit, and I'm gonna show y'all the whole process. So the only thing gonna be left is the Lambo and the cash prizes. So y'all gonna have 30 more days to jump on that, but the hell can't gonna go in 30 days. Wow. When is the next bad kid? Nigga said, I need that cat. <laughs> he said, I need the cat. That boy KJ so smooth. Nah, I ain't with Jay right now. Yeah, we're going to let the. Um, shout out to everybody signed up. There's a lot of people. So. How I'm feeling, we're gonna let the we gonna let the Hellcat go in 30 days. We're gonna go live, we're gonna show y'all everything legit. They're gonna come get it so y'all can see. <laughs> Mika crazy. <laughs> he said, Can I enter? <laughs> no, Mika. <laughs> but yeah. What up, Tyranny? Or not, bro? You should say, or not, what? I need that cat. Just say hell cat next to it, because I need that cat. What cat? But yeah, man, y'all stay tuned.